There are many different computational tools for engineers. And I'm going to be reviewing a few of those um, in this course. And you can find additional material uh, for this course at, uh, it's going to, if you go to the web, you can go to apmonitor.com uh, and there's going to be a link there. Or if you just want to type in CHE. Uh, 263. This is Chemical Engineering 263. Uh, it's, it's regarding computational tools for engineers, but also titled Problem Solving Techniques for Chemical Engineers. So uh, we're going to be using computers to be able to solve problems, engineering problems. Um, you know, I'm just returning right now from Equatorial uh, Guinea or Guinea. Um, I was on this platform here off in the uh, offshore platforms and we had to uh, you know these these floating structures right here have tendons that go down and attach to the seafloor we used uh, different com computational tools to be able to analyze this strain create interfaces for the operator and it made me think about some of the ways in which we use computers to enhance or enable certain uh, things like in this case exploration and drilling of oil and gas okay so I'm off here right now um, in uh, this is Equatorial Guinea off of the uh, west coast of Africa and uh, you know if I brought a couple tools to the platform if I thought about what I would need in my bag of tools um, you know there's there's different tools for different things um, and the same goes for you know computational tools we well, might have some some uh, very particular you know tools that are just specific for a particular job like wire stripping or sawing a branch or drilling a hole in something uh, out on an oil rig you might need heavier duty ones uh, ones that can deal with big data big uh, you know uh, so in, in the case of computational tools something that's going to deal with um, you know extreme number crunching or big data those types of things so really depends on what the task is and we're going to be reviewing a few of these computational tools and be able to give you a summary uh, so that when you have a problem you'll know uh, kind of where to start which tool to use and also get you familiar with some of the tools that are out there for engineers okay so go to this website you'll see the syllabus homework problems examples videos and other things related to computational tools uh, for engineers